Is investing in Jamaica real estate a scam? Well, if you want to find out, just stay tuned. But let me tell you some stories because my mom has had her fair share of situations that didn't turn out the way that they were supposed to. So back in the days, there's been quite a few situations where my mom was trying to purchase some land sight unseen. And when she actually went to the property, there was nothing there. So the people got over on her because she didn't do her own due diligence. When it comes to investing in real estate, you're taking on a risk. So it is very, very, very important for you to do your due diligence prior to transferring a single cent to anyone. When my mom tells me these stories, I find it funny because she received the short end of the stick due to her own negligence. And that wasn't the only situation. Before I came down here, my mom would send money so that they could pay taxes on some of the properties that she owns. And when I came down here, I went to the tax office so that I could pay the tax for the current year. And I found out that the properties were about five years behind on taxes. So I had to pay up all those back taxes in order to bring it up to date. But luckily in Jamaica, property taxes isn't that expensive. So I had to pay about $500 to $600 in order to bring it up to date. But that just shows you that you have to know who to trust when it comes to money, because no one is going to care about your money more than you. And since I've been living out here, I realized why people do the things that they do because minimum wage is less than a hundred dollars per week and that is difficult to survive off so if you want to make an honest living in this current economy you're really struggling to survive so if you allow them to get over on you that's exactly what they're gonna do and there's another story about how my friend almost got scammed so a situation had transpired so the length of time that she had to stay at her current residence expired and she needed to find another place to stay so she was looking online and she found a nice place. She went and visited in person and that kind of made her have a gut feeling that something was up. Because when she visited the place, there was a helper there and she was asking the person questions and they didn't really know how to answer the questions. And the person that was there when she went to view the property wasn't the same person that she was speaking to on the phone. So the guy asked her to send first, last and security. But since she had a gut feeling that something was wrong, she asked one of her relatives that's an attorney for some advice on the situation. And she was advised to ask for some documentation along with proof of ID so that she could confirm that this person is legit. And when she received the ID, she saw that there were some discrepancies. And once she saw that, she didn't send him a dime because that boy was trying to commit a crime and he should be doing time. And I said all of that to say this there is a possibility that you can get scammed if you're trying to invest in real estate in Jamaica. Because at the end of the day, it is an investment. So there's risk associated. So you have to do your own due diligence prior to investing in any form of asset. But just because you can be scammed doesn't make real estate investing in Jamaica a scam. I'm not sure if you noticed, but the most expensive real estate in the Caribbean is in Jamaica and Barbados. So if you're looking for a long-term investment that's going to continue to appreciate over time, then Jamaica is the place for you. But if you're looking for a place to fix and flip so that you can make a lump sum of cash and move on to the next deal, then this might not be the place because the real estate process in Jamaica is much slower, especially if it's not an all cash deal. As they say, scam means you're still confused about money. So if you're uneducated about the industry or the market, then you shouldn't invest there. Invest in what you know so that your money will continue to grow. So is investing in real estate in Jamaica a scam? No. And right now is a perfect time to invest in Jamaica because we are currently experiencing a real estate boom. When it comes to investing, you want to get in while the wave is forming and ride that wave so that you could continue to get paid. Because five to 10 years from now, property prices in Jamaica are going to skyrocket. And you never know. If you invest now, the future returns might allow you to buy a rocket. But it's about that time. So if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and click the bell so that you're notified every time I make a new post. Until next time.